What's going on Wolf Gang? Today is Monday, aka My Hero Monday. And with that being said, guys, we have received some DLC information, hence the kimono outfits and their prices. Now listen to me carefully, guys. I need you to listen carefully for anyone who doesn't know this. Check this ch ch check this nonsense out, alright? So I'm, I'm gonna speak on terms from people who don't have the season pass, right? So Let's say you didn't buy the season pass, right? But you want to buy Kendo, correct? So let's say you're getting Kendo. That's $4, right? Am I correct? $4. $4 for Kendo. Now get this nonsense, guys. This is what really ticked me off to the fullest. I cannot believe they actually did this. So as you guys know, when it comes to DLC outfits, the stuff is already $12 alone. You know, $11.99, right? Am I right, guys? Am I right? Like, for example, if we go to the cheerleader outfits for may she was two dollars and of course everybody here is twelve dollars right it's two four six eight eight characters for twelve dollars correct not a problem not a problem right check this nonsense out so if you wanted to get kendo and get kendo's cheerleader outfit you're already spending six dollars right crazy right get this nonsense so if you want to buy the plain clothes for everybody, it's not together guys check this nonsense out so if you want to get deku Ochako, Ida, Todoroki together. That's four. Four characters, $12. Crazy, right? And let's just say, okay, well, well, what about the other ones, Draco? Same thing. If you want to get Bakugo, Dinky, Mina, and Mineta, same thing, $12. They decided to instead put eight characters together to make it $12. Nah, fam, we're going to split them up. We're going to make four characters $12 each. So if you want to buy the entire thing alone, that's $24, right? So let's just throw in May. Not May. My bad. My bad. Kendo. 24 plus the four for Kendo. That's 28 plus the $2 for Kendo's cheerleader outfit. For that whole entire set, Wolf Gang, you're spending $30 just for all that. Me personally, I don't vibe with that. I mean, luckily, I got the season pass, so I can, I, I can those out the window. $4 is out the window. Ten, $2 might, might just because, you know, I might do the cheerleader outfit just because of the nerf or buff video just to have her in there. But this right here alone is what I'm kind of skeptical about. Like, it would have been okay if you would have put all eight characters together and then said, boom, plain codes, $12. I don't know why they decided it was okay to split these two up and make it $12 separate. If anything... It should have been one pack should have been $5.99 and then the other pack should have been another $5.99 or $4.99. But if it was going to be $12, that would have been perfectly fine. $6 for each pack. Does it, you know, it would have made it $12. If you wanted to be complicated, I mean, you could still threw them together and then $12. But I don't know why they thought four characters is going to be worth $12. Like, what? What? And I'm speaking... For everybody, including myself, because this is honestly ridiculous. I feel like this shouldn't have been a thing. Why is this $12 for each pack? Like, what? And I'm speaking for this now, and I guarantee you guys, when this drops, who's going to be the idiot to buy it? That's right, your boy Draco. So, that being said, Wolfgang, I'm, I'm actually upset about this for, for once. This is like the dumbest DLC idea that they've done. I really thought they were just going to throw all eight characters together and call, call it, you know, $12. But no, separately sold product, $12. Separately sold product, $12. $24 just for these eight characters alone. Ain't that some BS? Boy, I know people are going to be living in the comments. I can I can, I can, can see the comments now. Then you got $2 for Kendo and then $4 for Kendo itself. This I don't have a problem with. I don't have a problem spending $2 just to buy her cheerleader outfit. I did the same thing with May. No problem whatsoever. It's this that's getting me upset. So, yep, that's that's what I wanted to let you guys know for the playing clothes. The playing clothes will not be sold together, sadly. They will be sold separately, $12 each. No release date yet, but that's it, guys. I'm terribly sorry that you have to you have to see this, but that's what it is, Wolfgang. Um, let me know in the comment section below how you feel about that. Please, please speak your thoughts. Speak your opinion. Speak how you feel, because whatever you say, I'm pretty sure I'm going to agree with it. 
That being said, Wolf Gang, let me know in the comment section below how you feel about this. Um, if I come up with any more information about Kendo's release day, if somebody sends it to me like they normally do with Hawks in May, pretty sure Nintendo Switch is going to drop a release date in the store like they did with Hawks in uh, May. So that'll probably be the next time you hear about an update when it comes to One's Justice 2. So if you guys can do that, be on the lookout for that for me. And, um, you know, I'll keep you posted. Other than that, I don't know how I feel about this DLC. I don't know if I'm even going to, you know, throw my money towards this. Not only just because... It's twelve dollars, but the fact that you know you're spending twelve for you know two different things, it's kind of it's kind of wasting money. But you know, I'm speaking this now and knowing me, videos, content. <laughs> anyway, Wolf Gang, love you guys. Hope you enjoy your Monday. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comment section below. Love you. 100 likes, maybe. Matter of fact, 150. Let's give this video 150 likes, Wolf Gang. 150. Love you guys. Turn on the bell for notifications. Subscribe. Love you, and I will see you guys later. Jose.